I interrupt today's regularly scheduled Toe content with a quick editor's announcement. You may notice that we have a new intro along with new intro music, and I just wanted to give a quick shout out to the writers and producers of the music. Huge thank you goes to Sammy Roan, Matt Poss, and George Ozier for writing and producing this song specifically for our channel. The song is titled Toe and Them Bones, and it was written specifically for this channel after watching hours and hours of our content. Not only is Sammy a very talented musician, but also a close family friend, so if you have a moment, please go to their channel and check out the full song on their YouTube. All of that information will be linked in the description box of every video going forward, just to credit these talented musicians who wrote this song dedicated to our channel. I hope you guys enjoy, and without further ado, let's roll the intro. Okay guys, I uh, got called over here to Zoders. Looks like somebody did some bad things and went to jail. And uh, we're gonna get it out of here. Hey, if you got keys, I'll bring it up here for you. All right, let's see if I can get her up here. They just didn't want you parking there? Oh, okay. I had a guest leave a bottle of medicine in the room. Uh -huh. She couldn't get it, I give it to her. She swore I stole 54 pills out of her bottle. There wasn't even 20 pills in the bottle and I gave her back everything. Well, in the world, yeah, they didn't tell us why. I, I thought, I thought, well, it local plates. I thought maybe you were staying there or something. No, no, That's... no. My boss took, believed the guest over me and fired me. Really? And I got arrested wow. and I got charged. That's with, crazy. Uh, theft. Wow. You would think they'd have to have proof or something like that. Huh. I screwed up in the middle of taking one out of the bottle. Oh. Oh, that's awful, dear. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's why I was questioning why it was so much. Yeah, they, like I said, they, they didn't tell me. They didn't tell me why. They just, oh. it was, I, oh, yeah, I didn't but, have but any he keys. Had no, he had no problem going around telling everybody, everybody that he's related to and everybody that I worked with that I stole and sold 60 pills <laughs> with no proof. Wow. The cops searched me, searched all my belongings, searched my car. There was no pills. And they, well, I wouldn't think they could they could charge you for it if they couldn't find any. That's kind of weird. I don't know. Dear. Yeah, they didn't tell us. And I'm sorry. I, like I said, I just didn't. I don't have any keys. And it was like all-wheel drive. Tried, I tried to get them to leave the keys in the car. Yeah. But then they'd already brought them to me and they wouldn't go back to put them in the car. Oh no. Yeah, it was but hard way, for us. Yeah. Because I it was know, there was cars. The four wheel drive and, and it all was those, cars. Yeah. Every, it took us for, a disaster. Yeah, right? it took us forever to get it out of there. Let me get you this receipt here. Thank you. The honest person that gave her back and told her, I took one pill. No. See, yeah, that's that's crazy. I'm she she planted it. Yeah. She that's... came in, stayed in the room, stuffed the bottle under the mattress pad on the mattress. Really? This was just some out-of-town guest? Mm-hmm. The script was for 180 pills. She had filled it on the 24th mm -hmm. of February, and there wasn't 20 pills in the bottle. She's sold them yeah. or took them, and she needs the pills so she had to have a police report to be able to get a new script. To get a new, yeah. Gosh. And I got screwed. As long as you are on his good side. Yeah. But he, 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 he wouldn't back me. He didn't back me. When he found out I took one pill, he wanted me off the property. He wanted me locked up and off the property. Well, you try to have a better time, ma'am. Thank you. All right, guys. You heard it straight from the horse's mouth on that one. I, so guys, I know I get a lot of comments about that stuff. Uh, I, I have no opinion in the matter. The, all I'm doing is agreeing with these people. I don't, I don't have any opinion, and it doesn't matter. I'm just here doing my job, and they're paying me for picking up their car that they. So yeah, she got arrested, um, and that's the same thing that the people, the the uh, the hotel owner told me that she was an employee and she stole and went to jail for stealing and theft. So. And uh, like I said, I have no opinion. I'm, I'm just agreeing with her to get her out. Um, but it sounds like, you 
you know, you, you heard it first. She she did take one pill, and I guess they were claiming that she had she had taken more of the prescriptions. But you, I don't care if it's one pill or twenty pills. It's just not you. <laughs> you shouldn't be taking people's medicine. And um, apparently, it was just an out of town guest, and she was she was working for them cleaning cleaning the hotel, and uh, that that customer that guest come back after their prescription and said that there were 20 pills missing and uh it's sad guys it, it's really is it's i don't know why people would ever want to take something that doesn't belong to them whether it's physical items or prescriptions especially prescriptions like it's just not a good idea but anyway she's got her car back and um i don't know she got she got charged with uh with that and it kind of sounds like a bad deal but maybe she'll uh maybe she'll learn from it and move on anyway stick around stay tuned we are on our way hopefully to do this winch out this guy's been waiting on me so winch out time stick around so i had to add one more thing to that don't take random mattress pills <laughs> it's not a good idea random mattress pills could be could be hazardous to your health so Stay away from them. Mattress pills. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Take a little trip down Booger Town Road. <laughs> Booger Did Town Road. Anyway guys, welcome back to the channel and we are on uh, Rose Pass. This poor guy, let me tell you, he called me, he's all out of breath. He said, you're gonna have to give me a second. I'm trying not to die in front of my kid. <laughs> he's trying to catch, catch up there. And he went off the road, tried to make it up, didn't make it up, went back down, ended up in the ditch. So we're gonna see if we can get this fine family back to having oh, fun. There it is. In 600 feet. You will arrive at your destination. I'm glad it's not up there, up this gravel. That's a pretty good ditch. It is a good ditch. Turn right. Okay, you can hush. Thanks. Yeah. What is that, an explorer? Looks like be a new explorer, yeah. Yeah, it looks like that's like a fairly new road. Holiday road. <laughs> no, I'm gonna try that. I wouldn't swear to it, but I'm going to try it. Don't feel bad because it happens all the time. Yesterday was our week. Well, unfortunately, there's somebody else that's taking it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, kind of weird. So we're thinking we could just park right there tonight. <laughs> that might be a safer. Maybe a little safer. See nothing.
turn the wheel. Okay. Is it are the keys in it? The keys. He has the key. Okay, I had a hard time getting that to go in between, in between the, wheel that. And the rotor. I just wanted to make sure that was okay. What are the odds of getting in the other side? I don't think it's going to want to stay hardly at all. It looks like it levels up pretty quick. I'm about up there in the front. What sounds? It's the heat shield on that exhaust. Oh, okay. It's just heat shield on exhaust. I promise. There was it's some, a there was something liquid running out, but I'm water. Just it was water. just water. Yeah. Yeah. Back around, see that silver stuff back in there? It's all heat shield, so it's it makes a whole lot of noise, but okay. it's just a little like a little aluminum barrier. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, that front end's about up there. It should spin over here for us. That is. It's like deep. Yes, it is. Straight ahead. Cancellation Nation is where we're headed, guys. At least that's what we like to call it. Every time we get halfway out of here, they'll call and say, never mind. In 1,000 feet, your destination will be on the left. We got her out. <laughs> Some local out here with a board and a rope that does this thing. Anyway, uh, sounded like some young girls went off the driveway and there was lots of giggling involved, so I'm guessing it's not horrible. Is that it right there? That's it. But they said they didn't want to get out of the car because they were afraid. Oh, that's Your bad. destination is on the left. That's a good question. St. Patrick's Day, spring break. Oh, that's bad. They've got to be just absolutely terrified. This guy's like, oh, I'll just walk. Oh, yeah, I, I'm going to be way faster than you driving up there, so I'll just walk in front of you. Let me uh, just grab this cooler real quick. Get this cooler out of the way. Okay. What did they do? Well, they missed horribly. Yes, yes, they did. Yeah, I'm glad she's still in there on her break. She needs to stay. What are they doing? Stay there. Stay there. No, they're. 
what is she doing? It's like I get here and they decide to put everything into place once I start pulling up. Mm. And now they're gonna get stuck. Why couldn't they have just like stayed where they were? They're gonna put her right directly in your way. Kids. Spring break, 2023. Mm. They wanna see the show, man. People down there on the main road are rubbernecking. Rubbernecking. I mean looky loos. Look, she's hung up now. Why didn't she just stay there? There's plenty of room. Nope, now they're going to discuss it. She can go back where she was and be fine. If there was this many people out directing to begin with, <laughs> <laughs> who wouldn't be in this mess?
Any last words for YouTube? Uh, this might be a sign not to get married. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Good job, guys. Nobody got hurt. The car's okay. You had to call your gun if you wrecked another car. No, no. Nobody did hurt. Nobody did hurt. Nobody hurt. Nobody hurt. Uh, where does she, she said, want she it? She said back it in front of the black car. In front of the black car? Back it down in front oh. of the black car, yes. Chows, and that's just as good as whiskey in my book. So. <laughs> I think here in the Smokies, corn makes moonshine. Maybe. It has rained and it is spring break, and this has resulted in lack of traction. Zurich. No. <laughs> Zurich. <laughs> We're on Zurich. Always want to say Zurich. Because that's how it's spelled. But we're close, less than a minute out. Uh, had a customer call in with a Ford Explorer. Says two wheels in the ditch. And that's never good when it's like a good size SUV. You hear Ford Explorer in the ditch and you're like, what kind of ditch is this to eat a Ford Explorer? It's not a Ford Fusion. Mm, no. From 600 feet, your destination will be on the right. Uh, have we been to this one? Do you see it? Yes. I see it. It doesn't look like front tires. It looks like side tires. It certainly does. Oh my oh goodness. God. What was that? My Your tires. destination is on the right. <laughs> okay. I don't know that we've ever pulled anybody out of this ditch before. Ugh. This is going to require cones and vests and lights. I don't like this one because oh, yeah. anytime my front end is this high, it likes to come up even higher. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can get a low pool and just hook the front and just pull it old school white truck way. That would be cool. That would be cool. Oh, it's so steep. Like, <laughs> it's like roller coaster takeoff. There's no way you can keep a tire on the ground. I mean, it's crazy. The beauty is just bare. Feels like it wants to pop a wheelie right now. Yeah, I ain't doing that. Mm. Wheel chocks. Wheel chocks for sure. I'm gonna go put some cones up here so that we don't get run over.
Okay, I guess while we're waiting on the keys, I will show y'all what this looks like. Super steep. Not sure if they were trying to back up or if they just lost traction and slid backwards. Okay. So we've got a pretty good sized drainage ditch over here on this side. Be careful that leaves there. down here and get some keys we'll get it turned i'm not sure what that was I think it was a rabbit it is a rabbit Woo! we'll get some keys i think i got a little bit of clearance off of it picked it up just a little bit uh but it should turn the hard left and work it up out of there a little bit of time so stay tuned He'll steer hard right or yeah right. He's ready. You're gonna steer hard right. And then you're going to you want it neutral? Yeah, just let off the brake. Put it on the brake. Put it neutral. Slowly let off the brake. Let me know when you're off. Just hold that hold that foot over the brake. Put the brake. Okay. He's ready. Yes. Hold that, hold the brake right there for me. Okay. Pull forward, guys. I'm not gonna be able to get it with one, with one swoop. Hold on, let's grab this up. Yeah, I figured I'd get close. Okay, is he out of the hole yet? I think he's. 
Yes, he's on pavement. Yeah, that's fine. I'll let loose from there. I think the e-brake's on. Is it on? Yeah, parking brake. No, no, it's not on. Okay. Let's see. So, yeah. Yeah, just close it off the brake. Huh? He has no traction. That back tire looks like it's locked up. Yeah. Well, now, this isn't rear-wheel drive. Yeah, but it, it looks like, is it an electronic parking brake? Yeah, oh, well, no, it's a manual. A manual? Uh-huh. Boy, it sure looks like, it sure squatted down like the parking brake was on. There, oh, I was almost, huh? turn, uh, turn, yeah, there you go. Try that. Yeah. There you go. There you go. There you go. Now come back to me. There you go. It's just so steep. It yeah. Like you get. You ought to be able to go backwards now if that's if that's the path we're trying to get to. Okay. I would just put it into neutral and then just coast down backwards. I would straight straighten your wheel up for me. Come okay. come back to, towards me. Towards me. There you go. Right about there. Now just ease backwards. Ease on down. You're in good shape. There you go. Probably just straight from there. You got all kinds of room over here. Yeah, he'll be in good shape. Okay, he's trying to go to this driveway here on the left. This one here? Turn yeah, to keep. The right, just slightly. There, there you go. Right, down straight. There you go. There you go. Keep straight, keep going back, keep going back, keep going back. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming back. I think you can turn in there. I think. <laughs> yeah, you got it. If, if the traction will work, because it's still as steep as you can be. I've got it in first gear. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> first gear and it still wants to roll backwards. Isn't that crazy? You're in good shape if you keep that path. The front end will drop down. You should be able to see where you're going in a minute. I got the camera on just so I can sort of follow it. I know, isn't it crazy? Oh yeah, he's go. good there. Right. Perfect. All right, we'll get you this ticket here. Guys, it's a uh, camera. Camera doesn't even come close to showing the, that's so steep. If you have any indication how steep it was, he was, he was in first gear, giving it gas and it was still going backwards. <laughs> we have, um, you can see my truck kind of level. My camera is level, I'm not sure. It's dark out, but my goodness, guys. It's steep, but we got him out of there and uh, we're gonna get some cones picked up and quit blocking the road.